What's going on, Astro Tribe? This is the Astro Mystique, and I'm back with another video. We're going to get into it. This is going to be for any ill intentions that may be um, shooting your way, energies that are trying to um, bring any blockages your way. If you're dealing with any enemies, hexes, curses, jealousy, envy, y'all stay tuned. We're going to get into it now. So the first thing you do want to make sure you have is all of your essentials okay and also you want to make sure that you start with smudging your sacred space so go ahead and do that and we're going to get into using your protection powder okay this powder is very good to cast your circle and i actually just cast a circle around my entire perimeter of my spell you could do the same or if you want you could actually use the powder to carve any type of sigils for protection and so on and so forth the next one you want to go into is making your conjure oil and um, this oil you will be using to dress any of your candles um, yourself with your mojo bag as well and yeah make sure that you uh, have all your equipment for that as well so you can make your own and if you can't make your own, go ahead and order your pre-made hoodoo oil. So the next thing you're going to do is go ahead and start dressing and blessing your candle. Of course, you guys, this is a special candle specifically for this ritual. So make sure that you have a white and black double action candle. Carve your, your sigils in it. Speak your intentions while you're carving. Anoint your candle with the oil and... Go ahead and dress it with your herbs. So we want to get into you making your mojo bag, okay? This bag, you will not be using it on Saturday. Saturdays are actually great for preparation of your omelet. So you can go ahead and make your bag, again, like I said, Saturday. You want to make sure you feed your bag weekly on Sundays. All right, so we're going to go ahead and get into your next trick. You're going to go ahead and make some smudge incense. This incense will be used to smudge your mojo hand. Also, you can use the herbal blend to dress your candles with. And um, you can set it around your candle as well. Mm -mm -mm. All right, you guys. So, we're going to get into our last but not least steps is you're going to do some invocation, okay? For me, I actually am um, invoking Eshu energy because specifically I am going for uncrossing and opening up some pathways in my life right now. So, if you are familiar with Eshu, if you're not, you can still look it up. Um, he will be a great deity that you would invoke. And I hope that you guys got a lot from this. I hope that you will receive whatever blessings that you have. And I thank y'all all for watching. Make sure you like, subscribe, and comment below if you like. And uh, take it easy.